Hi, this is Steve. Thanks for watching. In this video, you'll learn about the rare red splat. Very few people have ever seen it, and I am very excited to share it with you. Hi, my name is Steve Wyborny. I am the creator of Splat and Fraction Splat, which you may have seen. I've given away over a million copies of Splat files to teachers around the world, but very few people have ever seen this one. It's the Rare Red Splat. Now, you may already have noticed that there is something new on the screen, which is the rule on the bottom of the slide. The rule is what sets this splat apart. The rule is also what makes these splats so rare, and the rule is different on every slide. Let's take a closer look. We're looking at the PowerPoint file, which you can download from my blog. It's free, it's ready to use, and it works with either PowerPoint or Google Slides. Also notice that there are five different levels. I recommend using the level that is the best fit for your class. Every level begins with a blank screen. On the first click, several things appear at the same time. You can see the red splat, a black splat, and some dots. Then on the next click, the rule appears on the bottom. I recommend reading it very carefully. In this case, the rule for this picture, the value of the red splat is one more than the value of the black splat. What is the value of the red splat? You can tell that the rule comes before the total, and that opens up space for conversation. Then when you're ready, the next click shows the total. In this case, it's 10. The next three clicks include suggested questions. What is the value of the red splat? And how do you know? The next question is, how else could you know? This is the most important question in a splat series. This is the question that causes students to think more deeply, look for more connections, and share their reasoning. This also happens to be the most important question for initiating classroom joy. The reason is because it establishes multiple invitations to the same question, and students will amaze you with their ideas. The third box is actually not a question. Let's look under the splat to find the value. It's a signal to you that you are one click away from revealing the answer, so don't click again until you're ready. When you do click, you'll see that the first value revealed is the one under the black splat. So there is actually one more opportunity for conversation before the final reveal. And then with the next click, you see the value of the red splat. In this case, it's four. Don't be surprised if your students want to go back and read the rule again. They may even come to understand some of the ideas in the rule in a new way now that they're actually looking at a picture of the words. You can see that there are some yellow slides beginning at level two. Level two begins with a reminder. If there is more than one black splat, each of the black splats has the same value as each other. Two black splats appear as an example. Along with a the note, these will have the same value as each other. Then as you click, the splats and dots appear. And remember, the rule is different on every slide. In this case, the value of the red splat is two less than the value of each black splat. The routine is exactly the same. When you click, it will show the total, the three text boxes, and then it will reveal the value of the black splats. And finally, the value of the red splat. In this case, the value is seven. And if you return to the rule, you can see that the value of the red splat is two less than the value of each black splat. Let's move on to level three. Level three begins with the same reminder. And then on the first click, there are three black splats. This time the rule is that the value of the red splat is one more than the sum of the black splats. You can see that the total is 21. And the question as always is what is the value of the red splat? Now on this slide, I will not spoil the answer. Instead, let's move to level four. In level four, there are two black splats and one red splat. You can also see two dots. This time the rule is the value of the red splat is two and a half times the value of each black splat. The total is 29 in this case. Level five is even more challenging. The rule for level five is the value of the red splat is three and one half times greater than the sum of the black splats. What is the value of the red splat? The total is 32. Like all the other levels, it's the same routine. What is the value of the red splat? How do you know? How else could you know? Let's look under the splat to find the value. And then when it's time, there is the reveal. Remember that the black splats are revealed first. In this case, the value of each one is two. 
Finally, the value of the red splat is revealed. In this case, it's 21. 21 is 3 and 1 half times greater than 6. The file that we're looking at right now is labeled part 1 because there are several other copies of the rare red splat and they will all be available on my blog. If you'd like to download your copy, read the description below and it will tell you where to download your copy of the rare red splat. Before I go, I wanted to end this time with something a little bit different, so I'm going to give you a preview of what's coming up in the next video. Thanks for watching and enjoy the preview.